Hi, I'm State Fire Marshal Butch Browning. This week's Marshal message is to remember to think. My friends, every day we're busy. Every day we are executing uh, the responsibilities, the awesome tasks of protecting the lives of the people in our cities, in our districts, and in our state. That awesome task requires quick action. It requires very decisive leadership. It requires you to be at your best at all times. I'll tell you, the day we take those decisions lightly, the day that we don't analyze the processes that bring us to a decision, certainly in emergency response, those split second decisions save lives. And it's all the training and it's all the wisdom that we gather as leaders that help us make those right decisions that extinguish fires real quickly and control them, uh, that save lives and take people out of harm's way. But also in our everyday operations of our organization, we've got to learn that thinking is the most important thing that we do. And before you make a decision, stop and pause. And in that pause, make sure that you've learned everything about the problem, make sure you've learned everything about the task before you make that decision. A great example uh, is in personnel matters. You know, I've always found that when, when I get a phone call uh, from a citizen or ev even a, another employee who has a complaint, who has a concern, many times until I get both sides of the story, I haven't learned the whole picture to create the right results, to create the right remedies to solve that conflict or solve that problem. We've just got to take our pause from time to time and learn all the facts before we make decisions. That'll always keep us a steadfast, middle of the row, and credible leader. So remember together we can bring about better safety, better service, and a better quality of life to all in Louisiana if we could just remember to think. Now. Let's hear from this week's local leader. Hi, I'm Chad Sonia with the Scott Fire Department. As fire chiefs, decisions that we make now affect the quality of life for years to come in the communities that we serve. Therefore, it is crucial that we analyze problems, identify and evaluate the options and explain choices based on solid reasons and evidence. At the fire stations, we spend countless hours teaching fire ground tactics so operations can run smoothly and efficient during emergency incidents. All of the skills we teach, none are more valuable than the ability to critically think during problems. A huge misconception is that the fire service is a paramilitary organization and firefighters should not be decision makers. It is our duty to change this way of thinking and teach them how to think. Situation awareness is the foundation for good decision making. Situation awareness is formed by observing and understanding what is happening in your environment allowing you to predict for future events. In a world where technology has influenced our behaviors to do things faster, we are busy meeting the next deadline and often forget to slow down and think when confronted having to make a decision. In our line of business, this could result in a deadly outcome. It is vital to our organization's success that we never stop thinking. It is also imperative that we teach other firefighters how to think which will allow them to develop situation awareness and possibly save their life. As leaders, it is also our obligation to continue getting feedback and learning from others. This will allow us to continue to learn and grow. Successful leaders never stop learning and teaching those they lead. Minnesota University football coach PJ Fleck sums it up best. With bad teams, no one leads. With average teams, coaches lead. But with elite teams, players lead. In today's society, there are many bad leaders, a few good leaders, and even fewer great leaders. In order to be a great leader, we must lead by example, share our knowledge, and constantly focus on the goals of our organization. Take command not only on the fire ground, but at the station and in your community by learning, thinking, and leading. Thank you very much, and have a great day.